Hi, it's Jesse from Bold Grid, and I'm here to answer a question from one of our users, Ava. Um, Ava is using the Creo Super Theme and uh, would like to know how to create a three column footer layout. Um, so I'm going to show you how to do that today. So right here, I have a uh, fresh Creo site um, from Bold Grid Inspirations. And if we look at the footer here, the footer is just these two rows um, with these links and these social media icons down here at the bottom. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and customize my site here. And in the customizer, what you're looking for is the footer design. So we're going to start off by going to design and then the footer and then the footer layout. Um, so what you can see right here um, is that we have these two white boxes. Um, this one's called the attribution links. This one's called the menu. And those correspond to uh, these links and these, this social media menu in here. Um, so each one of these uh, sections is going to be a row. And each uh, piece inside of it is going to be a column. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this second row. And I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these attribution links. And so I'm going to go and add my social media menu back in for this top row. And then I'm going to add um, the, let's say, the branding, my company name in here. And then I'm going to add a widget area. And then when you go to edit the widget area, uh, it will actually take you to a different section of the customizer where you can customize a widget. So for example on this one I'm just going to do a list of the site's pages. Uh, have some navigation down here in the bottom. And so now we have these three rows. Um, they're a little bit misaligned so I'm going to go back to my layout and I'm going to use the, uh, the layout options here. So I'm going to put this one in the middle on the left. And I'm going to put my branding in the middle center. And the widget area can stay where it's at. That looks good to me. So that is how you do it. That's how you create a three column layout uh, in, there, in your footer for Creo. Um, hope that answers your question, Ava. Please let us know if you have any more. We're happy to help.